Okay, I'm going to checking over the repairs that they did. They fixed um, item 2.5, the light fixture on the side of the garage. Uh, there's your propane tanks. Looks like this is the heater. Um, the estate sale crew hasn't um, cleaned out much. That wasn't a very successful sale. <coughs> so I can show you the price tag on those two sofas you liked. Um, they also said they repaired the wood rot on the two support posts. I'm not even sure where that wood rot was. Let's see, you've got 195 on the love seat and 295 on the sofa. Just FYI. 250 on the uh, the boy is free. No, he's not. Let's see. The dining table, six ninety-five with the chairs. The hutch was five ninety-five. Uh, let's see. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't didn't even look at the wood rot around the garage side pedestrian door. They said they repaired that. Let's go through this way. They just patched it. Um. Let's see where they patched that. Didn't clean it, but they patched it. Boy, this door is hard to close. There we go. Um, let's see here. You know, it's in the same condition as when we saw it. I just expected it to have a lot less stuff in it. Um, let's see. They put in a new garbage disposal. Um, let's see, I think the uh, caulking around shower tile, was that in the guest bath? I'm not sure. That looks like fresh caulking there. I don't see any issues. I'll check the master bath. Tell you the floors all look good. And you know, as I'm walking through here, I do. I like this house better than Westfield. It just And this master bedroom, much better than the other one. Love the laminate flooring, the fact that you have access to the lanai and the pool. And you're right, you put some privacy fencing up. Um, this will feel like your own little private oasis. Um, Let's see here. I would recommend maybe doing a survey, though. Uh, it would cost you some money, but you would need one for a fence permit anyway. And um, 
you know, since it was just family, fencing off family, um, I know, I just think it would be wise. Looks like it's freshly caulked along here, the garden tub. The owner said that the garden tub always had drained slowly. Um, so they think that's just a structural way it is sort of thing. I don't think there were any issues in here, but uh, um, yeah, I see some crack in the caulking along here. Uh, you may need to address that. Um, commode toilet. Oh, that's the guest bathroom. Sorry, I'm not doing this in any logical order here. And we also need to go out to the garage and look at the hot water heater because they said they took care of that. Okay. Absolutely, that's been freshly sealed. There's no wiggle to this toilet whatsoever. At least not with my strength. Let's take a look at that hot water heater. Okay, yeah. We don't have any loose wires or you know that uh, metal piping runs all the way to the unit now. You know, there is a wire there, but it looks like it's grounded. So I am no professional but it looks like they addressed the issue. Uh, let's see. Now the estate sales company will clear all of this out, so don't worry about that, and they are meticulous. I think that's all the repairs that they did. I will send you an itemized list. But again, this house just flows better. Um, you've got a real separation, unlike the Westfield house. You know, here you've got a real great room, and then your formal living room is is much more separated. Um, you know, the di the dining room is a defined space. The floors are nice, and yeah, the fact that you can walk right out your bedroom door onto the lanai to have a cigarette. That's not for nothing. So at 165, I think you guys are making the smart choice. Doesn't have the gorgeous view, but you can make your own. Just get a good landscaper in for the difference between 165 and 190. Um, good call. I feel good about it anyway.